So, hello everyone. Just sort of getting people back into the, uh, the energy of the prayer tree. Um, I took a little break from it because I think I was way too close to um, expecting a certain outcome from it. So um, I had to take a little, a little um, step back. So um, this tree is a fruit tree. It's a peach tree actually. And I'm told that fruit trees have, you know, a lifespan. They don't really last forever. Um, so this tree is not, is, has been here a while. So I don't know how much longer it's going to be, um, you know, flourishing, which it's really not flourishing because there are barely any leaves on it anymore. And I thought when we were doing the, when I was uh, planning the whole prayer tree, I wanted to see um, if the tree would respond in any way. So these are the prayers that have been hanging on the tree. You can see now that they're, they're getting light from the sun, the bright red materials being bleached out from the sun and um, but I wanted to show you <laughs> my little my little bird's wings fell down that way. there it is now it's flying again Woohoo! so I wanted to show you guys one thing that happened with the tree since I have put on the prayers and it goes all the way up here where there are still leaves and what in the heck is that? So last year, the year before, we didn't get any peaches on this tree and today I noticed there's a peach. Wow. So, <laughs> so, wow, 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 wow. So I'm, I'm just like <laughs> a little flabbergasted and a little um, in awe of this little tree. It's really, really trying to crank out something. And I think, I don't know, I'd like to take it as, um, I don't know. I don't know, I think maybe it was the tree, and I'd like to think it's the tree saying, thank you so much for the, the attention and all the loves, loves, all the love that has gone into the prayers that, um, that we have, we all have put on this tree. And I want also to thank you guys so much for participating in this little experiment and this little sort of, um, I don't know, a, just a, a giving of yourselves to, to do prayers for the, for the world, for this planet, for the people who need prayers and um, and prayer works. So uh, my prayer was to see something happen for this tree and and uh, <laughs> what I got was that. <laughs> so yay. Um, I'm so grateful. I'm grateful for all of it and I'm grateful that you guys took the time to um, to give up yourselves and to all the readers who did prayers for peace um, thank you that is now that I've made you guys totally uh, seasick and motion sick <laughs> that is the update for the prayer tree and um, and now 
here is Katie Moonchild saying her prayer for peace. Thanks, guys. Walk in beauty. Hello everyone, I'm Katie Moonchild. I'm here to say a prayer for peace. We pray for the power to be gentle, the strength to be forgiving, the patience to be understanding, and the endurance to accept the consequences of holding to what we believe to be right. May we put our trust in the power of good to overcome evil and the power of love to overcome hatred. We pray for the vision to see and the faith to believe in a world emancipated from violence, a new world where fear shall no longer lead men to commit injustice, nor selfishness make them bring suffering to others. Help us to devote our whole life and thought and energy to the task of making peace, praying always for the inspiration and the power to fulfill the destiny for which we and all men are created. And so it is. <laughs>